Hey guys, what is up? In today's video, we're going to show you how to use fire crystals in Whiteout Survival. Are you looking for a quick guide on how to get fire crystals? Stay tuned because this video is for you. So fire crystals can be obtained through Intel missions, although the amount that you receive from these missions is typically quite limited. So if you're looking for a more substantial quantity of fire crystals, you have the option to buy, to, to buy fire crystal packs from the in-game store. Uh... And additionally, you have the option to obtain fire crystals using Sunfire tokens in the State of Power shop. These Sunfire tokens can be obtained through various methods, such as completing maximum mission rewards and engaging in the, S in the SBS battle phase. So fire crystal shards are different from regular fire crystals. You can obtain fire crystal shards by purchasing packs. Uh, so th that's the difference. So fire crystal requirements. Uh, for furnaces, you need 132, uh, 158, 238, 280. 335 could say uh, respect, uh, respectively. So this is the table. Look at it. And yeah, that's how you get fire crystal. That's pretty much it. That's the video. Hope you liked it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, ring that bell icon. We'll see you on the next one.